What's up, friends of covers? John Ronald here, looking ahead to England against North Macedonia. This one kicks off Monday at 2.45 Eastern from Old Trafford as Euro qualification rolls on. England have won all of their matches played so far in Euro qualification. You might remember we made a little money on their game with Malta on Friday. Meanwhile, North Macedonia is coming off a 3-2 defeat to Ukraine. Now, they fell apart in that game. They had a 2-0 lead going into the halftime break, but then they conceded two goals, got a player sent off, and allowed the winning goal in the 83rd minute. So not only is morale not as high for Igor Angelovsky's squad as it could be, they're also going into this game without experienced defender Visar Musliev, suspended after that red card. That said, North Macedonia often is able to keep matches tight. There were no more than three goals in their four matches before that Ukraine loss, and three of those games had two goals or fewer. That defensive posture, especially with North Macedonia playing on the road, makes an over-under bet a bit more risky of a proposition than I'm willing to take. Let's look at England, whose manager Gareth Southgate put Trent Alexander-Arnold in an attacking form, gave him the 10 shirt, and watched the goals roll in. Alexander-Arnold scored, they had two penalties, and were able to roll past Malta. Southgate also got the chance to rest his UEFA Champions League winners from Manchester City after their jubilant celebrations just a few days before, so we might see some of those players worked in on this game since they've had a little more time to rest up after those celebrations. At home, and against a stronger team, maybe Southgate won't experiment as much, but that experiment with Alexander-Arnold wearing the 10 worked out well. He linked perfectly with Bukayo Saka, and Harry Kane got his traditional goal from the spot. No matter what Southgate does, England is going to have the edge in talent. Maybe not as sharp of an edge as they did against Malta, but this team understands its idea so well with the continuity that Southgate has and the talent that's in their ranks. I think they're going to do well at home, and that's why I like England to win both halves plus 114. They did so against Malta. I think they do it again at plus 114. If you want a little riskier, a little less risk rather, England halftime full-time is sitting at minus 200. You can keep an eye on that as well. Keep an eye on the Covers YouTube page. We got more picks from other sports, more stuff on soccer. It's all on the Covers channel. Check it out. Talk to you then.